I found these champagne and wine bottle corks for free at the reuse center because no one wanted them, I suppose. So let's paint them and turn them into Christmas ornaments. They do have price tags, so they were originally trying to sell them, but we found them at the free section. Some of them look really nice and I feel bad covering up the designs, so I'll try to use the more plain looking ones for this. I used white gesso to prime them with one or two coats all over. I tried making a blue-purple gradient background for a couple of them and then painted the rest of them red or blue. You could draw patterns on them with a paint marker. I made one with vertical stripes using a silver paint marker and white acrylic paint. The white paint might need a second coat to look good. A simple one is just polka dots with a paint marker or paint. I wish I could use the cold paint marker for this, it would go really nicely with the red, but it's still broken. On one of the blue ones I drew and painted these compound leaves. The Crayer Box paint pens I have are not great for delicate details though, they're a little too thick. Then I'm doing one with these circle designs with a dot in the middle, alternating between the silver and white. Horizontal stripes should be straightforward, but it became really wobbly and uneven. One of my favorites was the one with the white flowers on a red background. You could also decorate the tops and the bottoms of the corks. At this point I thought the set was a little too small, so I added two dark blue ones. One with star designs in alternating sizes and the other with spruce twigs and dots for white berries. But you need to hang them somehow too, so I tried piercing them with a needle and I broke the needle. Next I tried a paper clip. Well, it went through, but it doesn't have a sharp tip, so it broke off some of the cork and the painting. A safety pin, however, does have a sharp tip and it was robust enough to not break. After that I threaded a thin needle with white thread and pulled it through all the corks to make a bunting. If you hang them vertically, they'll keep spinning like this. I leave the champagne bottle corks for a different idea. But if you want to paint Christmas decor on a flat surface, this wood slice painting video might spark some ideas. See you there! I'm trying to get a nice paint dot for the thumbnail. Oops!